Good morning. Today I'm kind of having a migraine hangover kind of day. As you will have seen, I finally get it edited. Uh, at the end of yesterday's video, uh, my day ended with a migraine. So that means today is, like I said, migraine hangover, which basically means, you know, I'm exhausted. Um, <laughs> and I slept so hard that it's just, it's a bad day. It's a bad day. Uh, migraine, the days after migraines, and as you can, as you can see, it's hard to think. So, <laughs> bear with me. Um, but yeah, migraine, day two, days after migraines, are tricky. Very tricky. They're sluggish. They're hard to focus on much of anything. Um... Yeah, they're just bad. So, aside from editing yesterday's vlog, I'm going to basically just have a reading day. Um, hoping to get through <clears throat> most of two of the Christmas books. Because they are due back next Wednesday, which is today's Thursday. So, not that long to finish them. So, I'm hoping to at least get through these two. And then the rest of them will just have to be unfinished. But... Before I do any of that, let's do our advent calendar. Okay, so we're on video eight, which is right here. And it is Caribou Blend Coffee. Never had caribou coffee before, uh, so we'll see how this goes. It's a good thing I have backups, because every time I try something I haven't tried before, I'm not optimistic. <laughs> so it's a good thing I have backups in case this sucks. <laughs> I'm going to get that brewing, and then we're going to get to work. vlog is finally edited. It's two o'clock in the afternoon, guys. I am... Today is not a good day. So it took me forever to edit the vlog, but it's edited. And then I dealt with some other stuff that just really just set me off and just made things 10 times worse. But I'm not going to get into it. But basically... <sighs> Basically, the money I was expecting, I'm not going to be getting. Um, so, though, yeah. Means bills are <laughs> not going to get paid. Christmas presents are not going to get bought. <sighs> I just got to remember what I said last in yesterday's video that I just edited. Find the happiness. Take it one second at a time. And find other ways to celebrate Christmas. This does not have to be presents. It'll be fine. <sighs> I'm also trying to focus on the fact that it is only the 15th. I still have, what, nine days to shop. So I could come into the money, it, the universe, the positive vibes are going out into the universe. The money could be coming in. I could get something unexpected. I could still probably give some Christmas presents. I just have to focus on the fact that it's not over. It's not the end of the world. It's not fun. It's not making me feel good. But it's not the end of the world, and I will get past it. 
So I'm going to, the vlog is exporting. While that's happening, I am going to get back to my reading to try to just put myself into fictional world and calm down and <laughs> hopefully do something that makes this vlog worth watching. If not, it's a reading vlog. I hope you guys enjoy it anyway. Also, let me know what you guys are reading at the moment. I'd love to hear about it because I am always in the market for other books to read. I might not be able to read them very fast and might not be able to afford to purchase them, which now that I'm not getting this money, I'm also probably not going to be able to stay in Kindle Unlimited. So my reading is going to be limited to library books. And I have to learn, there's nothing wrong with library books, but I have to learn when I go to the library that there are only so many books I can read in the time that I am allowed to keep them. So I have to not go so crazy when I go to the library and only get like two or three books. Uh, yeah. But anyway, we're going to step away from the negative and go into the positive and get back to reading. It is so very dark in here, and it's not even 3.30 in the afternoon. But I just wanted to stop reading for a bit and give you guys a little update. I'm enjoying this book. It's called Always in December by Emily Stone. I'm enjoying it, but I'm already on page 118, and we haven't really even gotten to, like, the, the, the main plot that's in the blurb on the back. So... It's two people who are spending Christmas in ways they would prefer not to, and they run into each other, quite literally, and spend time together. Blurb says they keep running into each other, which we've seen so far. But it also says they run into each other in, like, different cities and stuff over a whole year. And I'm already uh, after page 100, and we're not even through Christmas yet. Like... We, it's been like maybe a week they've known each other and I'm already over 100 pages in and we're supposed to be seeing them over a whole year. That worries me a little bit that there's going to be a lot of time skips in here, which are not my favorite thing in the world. But beyond that, it's a pretty good book. Um, it's pretty straightforward. You don't know nothing like fantastic about it. It's pretty hallmarky, but I'm enjoying it. So I'm going to get back to it. Before I continue, I'm going to make a cup of tea because I am still coughing Still having some issues, so I think a cup of tea will help. So we're gonna get that made. Not sure which kind I want this time though. All right, that is brewing. You can probably hear it brewing. Um, I think one of my tasks next week, if not this weekend, is going to be reorganizing the pantry because it is a huge mess and I just made it worse by knocking over all the tea. <laughs> I think I'll have a cinnamon bun with it. Don't they look good? The problem is, is we put saran wrap over them and that's going to take up all that icing. But they'll still be tasty. I think I'm going to heat it up in the microwave though.
the universe provides. Oh, uh, one of my clients just sent me a Christmas tip, which I am so, so grateful for. And it is enough to at least get my mom a little something. So I am so thrilled about that. Unfortunately, it's not going to be able to get purchased until at least Monday if the storm that we're going to be getting is actually going to happen. I mean, I could order for pickup and then just pick it up on Monday, which I might actually do. Um, not sure what I want to get her, though. That's the thing. So, but uh, so, so touched and so happy right now. It's a huge turnaround for this day. Not as much as I was expecting from the other person, but it's something and it's it's a huge relief. So thank you to my client, but I, it, you have no idea how much this means to me. So thank you, thank you. So we are in the bedroom. It is 6.42. We finished dinner. Um, it's later than I wanted to be in here to continue reading, but I could not get myself off the couch after dinner. Um, but we're going to continue reading. I never got past the last update I told you guys about, so I'm going to hopefully finish this tonight. I'm going to try to do like an all-nighter and get it read. I don't know about that. It's 404 pages and I'm only just over 100, so maybe not. Might finish it tomorrow, though. This one that I also wanted to read today, obviously not going to be read today, but they don't have to be back till Wednesday, so I should get this one read as well, but not tonight. So I'm going to get back to reading. I don't know what I'm going to put on the TV while I read. I don't have any vlogs to watch, and I always get distracted by them anyway. Um, <clears throat> might just put on some ambiance, honestly. Anything with Christmas music, probably. So not only did we get a time jump in the story, but we also got a POV switch. <clears throat> it bothers me. That bothers me. But I'm going to try not to let it. It makes sense for the story. I understand it. But I just got used to being in the heroine's head. And now I have to be in the hero's head? It really bothers me that this front camera is not as good as the back camera at night. Nobody told me that when I got the phone. But anyway, it's quarter of nine and I'm not sure what time my mom's going to be going to bed. So I'm going to end the vlog here, even though I'm still reading. Um, I'm still enjoying it. It is a little jarring that it is a different, it's the guy's POV now. And it's also a little jarring that suddenly there are swear words on it, but they're not that often, so I think I can look past them. But I'm still enjoying it. I am almost to page 200, so that's good. That's about halfway. Um, but it's still not going to get done tonight, but I think I can finish it tomorrow. Uh, but it's just been, you know, 
uh, despite the challenges of earlier today, it's been nice just kind of sitting and listening to Christmas music and reading a Christmas book and really has helped me kind of relax and calm down and realize that everything that happened earlier is not the end of the world. It is not going to ruin my day or my week or anything. It's just a negative thing that happened and now it's time to move on from it. So uh, thanks for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember if you did to give it a big thumbs up because it really helps my channel. And if you want to continue to see these Vlogmas vlogs, which are getting a little tricky, but I'm going to keep going. Um, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Bye.